to film with friends Missing VHS videotape repeating Welcome back gals and guys Today we're looking at La Femme Nikita from 1990 This is uh, written and directed by Luc Basson uh, Who previously before this had done a movie called Big Blue Which I still think to this day I've never seen Or if I did it's been a long long time uh, I like this movie a lot It's a really great film uh, Samuel Goldwyn production, uh, Samuel Goldwyn Home Entertainment in, in association with Vidmark. It is in French and it is a subtitle version. So I, this is a brand new copy I remember buying from Best Buy back in the day. Uh, VHS subtitle, 117 minutes color, Vidmark Entertainment. Uh, I had previously seen The Professional with Jean Reno and Natalie Portman, written and directed by Luc Besson. I was a big fan of that. And then I think after that I'd seen... The Fifth Element, I had saw, had seen, whatever, whatever the proper grammar is. <clears throat> the Fifth Element in theater and became a fan of Luc Besson's visual style and his storytelling style. And so I backtracked and found La Femme Nikita, which I had already sort of heard of because in 1997 there was a TV show called La Femme Nikita, which was originally broadcast in Canada as Nikita. Then it was rerun in the United States, I want to say on the USA channel. I remember seeing stuff for La Femme Nikita. So there's a TV series that ran for several years based on this film. And this film was also remade in 1993 in English with, um, I believe, Bridget Fonda, but it was called Point to No Return. So there's the original version, 1990, the 1993 American remake, Point to No Return, and then the TV Canadian TV show that was rebroadcast in America as well. Uh, I really enjoyed Luc Besson's earlier work. Of course, he, he had stuff to do with like the Taken series and a bunch of other stuff in the 2000s, but his stuff in the 90s I'm a really big fan of. This is a cool addition to, to have. Again, Vidmark always released some really interesting stuff. The 1990 uh, subtitle version. Let's see what year was this. Artwork and Design, MCM XCI. So is that 1990? I don't know. I don't know what that is. I'm not good at Roman numerals. All right. So yeah. So you guys have seen this movie? Big fan of it. I think it's uh, really good. Obviously, it's a right before a professional, so he's kind of really developing his visual style and his storytelling style off of this one, and then his work went into professional, and he kind of made his name from there. I uh, enjoy this movie a lot. I think it's great. Let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.